In a stunning leap for space exploration, China's unmanned spacecraft has successfully landed on the mysterious far side of the moon, a desolate, uncharted realm few dare to venture. The Change 6 touched down in the enigmatic South Pole Lipkin Basin on Sunday morning, as confirmed by the China National Space Administration. Launched on May 3rd, this groundbreaking mission seeks to collect unprecedented rock and soil samples from this region, a feat never before attempted in human history. This daring expedition promises to unearth some of the moon's oldest rocks from the colossal crater at its south pole, the perilous landing, fraught with the challenge of communicating with spacecraft on the moon's hidden side, underscores China's pioneering spirit. Previously, only China had achieved this feat with the change for in 2019. Over the next three days, the lander will engage in an ambitious operation to gather materials from the moon's surface, an endeavor marked by many engineering innovations, high risks, and great difficulty, according to CNSA. Everyone is very excited that we might get a look at these rocks no one has ever seen before, enthused Professor John Burnett Fisher, a lunar geology expert from the University of Manchester. These samples could unlock profound insights into planetary formation and the origins of water in the solar system. After launching from the Wenchang Space Launch Center, the Change 6 orbited the moon, meticulously planning its descent. The lander separated from the orbiter to touch down on the moon's perpetual dark side. Utilizing an autonomous visual obstacle avoidance system, the lander meticulously identified a safe landing zone guided by the stark contrasts of light and shadow on the lunar surface, according to CNSA via state-run Xinhua News Agency. Hovering at about 100 meters above the lunar surface, the lander employed a laser 3D scanner before making a slow, controlled descent. The Kuikyata Relay Satellite provided vital support for this historic maneuver. Chinese state media hailed the successful landing as a historic moment, with applause erupting at the Beijing Aerospace Flight Control Center upon touchdown. Unlike previous missions, which collected volcanic rocks akin to those found in Iceland or Hawaii, the far side's unique chemistry could revolutionize our understanding of the moon. The Change 6 aims to collect approximately a kilogram of material using a drill and mechanical arm. Targeting the South Pole Lichen Basin, one of the solar system's largest impact craters. This mission could gather material from deep within the lunar mantle, offering an unprecedented glimpse into the moon's core. The moon's south pole is the next frontier for lunar missions, holding the promise of ice, a critical resource for future human bases on the moon, should the mission succeed. The Change 6 will return to Earth with its precious cargo, preserved in pristine conditions for detailed analysis. Initially, Chinese scientists will study the samples, but researchers worldwide will later have the opportunity to examine this invaluable material. This marks China's second lunar sample return mission, following the successful Change 5 mission in 2020, which brought back 1.7 kilogram of material from the moon's near side. China's ambitious lunar program includes three more uncrewed missions this decade, aiming to find water to establish a permanent lunar base. Beijing's vision extends to putting a Chinese astronaut on the moon by around 2030, competing with NASA's Artemis program, which targets a 2026 lunar landing. Will this be the start of another space exploration rivalry? What do you think? Let me know in the comments and please subscribe for more interesting videos.